Christmas break. Means time to come work. Right, Sienna? Yep. Sienna and Reagan at it. Well, the girls are sweeping the shop out. Late and sweeping the shed out. Good to have the extra help over Christmas break. I am taking the 9250 that dad ran for the corn crew. I'm gonna take it out. I'm not gonna wash it, but I am gonna blow it off. It's now gonna be trade in. The uh, combine we're getting does not have the air compressor system on it. We think, we feel like that's a, nut, a must. That's uh, really nice to have to blow stuff off when you're working at it, keep your bearings clean, and all that stuff. So. We we're going to take that system off of this one so we can put it on the new one that's coming in, the one that uh, that we we're able to get off a lot. But first, we're going to blow it off with old Leroy. Well, this isn't going to be near the job I thought it was. I just got to take off uh, the added feature we put on, which is uh, an extra air tank. The big air line coming from the main air tank that Dad uses to blow off his throat. Just got to take that off. The one that we're getting that doesn't have an air compressor on it, they're put, h and is putting the air compressor on for us, so it'll be a lot easier than I thought. There goes the floor sweeper process of getting all the stuff off the combine that we are not going to trade back in with it continues got some more uh, seasonal labor right there trips been sweeping floors pushing wheelbarrows it's a heavy trip yeah we use round bar concaves and this is what comes in them Lane's getting our round bars back out that we'll put in the new ones and uh Putting the ones that come with them back in. I got the uh, oh, the air compressor system, all that off. Now in the process of getting all this, uh, the true sight, the stuff that uh, navigates using the head off, which is that wiring harness is. Still don't have it all. Got parts of it. Work in progress. So got six guys hauling. They should get all the December contracts done tomorrow. So that's what we're doing today. I'm over at our Indiana grain facility. I'm moving our cameras that we use to load the trucks. Uh, basically all it is is a router, which makes its own Wi-Fi, so people can connect it with their phones. That connects to the camera, so. So they can see it loading from the piles from inside the trucks and the when to pull up and when they're in a good spot and all that stuff. I see Sean coming, I'll help get him loaded. I don't think I'll have it up in time for him to use it, but hopefully by the next truck when they get here. All right, I need power to our router. Camera plugs in, all hooked up. It's a new pick. People usually ask about that. Works on the phone. So they can see from the truck. There's Sean. His YouTube debut. All right, one loaded. Gordy's here, so let's hang around and load him too. All right, he's loaded. Let's see if I can get a drone up quick enough to get him leaving.
What are these guys doing? You guys look busy. Yeah, we're busy. We're trying out. Forgot to take the camera though. We're trying it out again. Oh, it's just over. Just under. What are we shooting at? That piece of plastic <laughs> out there. Anything yeah. that wiggles. <laughs> that one right there? Right there, that plastic. Second there. terrace? Yeah. See that earthworm? <laughs> Wanna shoot it? I don't know what he's shooting at. Are we not that orange thing? No. Oh, I see what you're shooting at. What are we shooting at? That piece of plastic out in the field to the left of ways. Did anybody hit anything? Oh, we've killed oh, everything. That plastic. <laughs> okay. I haven't got the tool to adjust the sight with me. It's at the house. That was close. We'll get the new and the old? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> Holy smoke. <laughs> Let's come way back here. Here, I'll go this way. I'm going to shoot that one. Come on. Get you ready to drop? M1. Safety's in front of the trigger. Push it forward. That was pretty close there. That's a good one. Yeah, that's a rifle. <laughs> that's when you push that forward in front of the trigger? Yep. Yeah. I just came for a dust mask. I'm glad I showed up. Well, that was fun. Those guys messing with the new type assault rifles and the uh, old type. World War II and then uh, modern day. I'm back at David's. I'm going to clean on a bin here. Another bin bites the dust. I think that makes eight for the year. Got another one running to fill up the hopper. I'm gonna go home, grab some lunch, take a look at a washing machine that's not behaving properly, and then uh, come back, make sure it got the hopper filled up and shut off. We got sensors to do that. Works good all the time, but doesn't hurt to check them. Where'd you go? Oh, he gone. Gordy has funeral today, so I'm taking his place. Back to 579 Pete. Hopefully this uh, works out better last time. Last time they even had driveline go out, so then I had to switch him truck. So, trucking today, be hauling yellow corn. And look who it is, I got a passenger. Ready to go? Well, we made it, and it's a ghost town, just the way we like it. Well, we're making our way back to Allendale, Illinois, to load at Fred's. We, uh, we're all loading in different spots. Me and Fred's are gonna load at his house. Uh, I think Garrett and David might be loading at Ed's, which is our smaller Indiana location. And then Sean's loading at Wilson's, which is our big Indiana location. That's who's driving today. Um, reviews on this truck. It's pretty nice. Um, it's a 10 speed, 10th right now. Just a little different. It's kind of like driving a car. Uh, I keep wanting to slam on a clutch that's not there and reach for a gear shifter that's not there, but not bad. Pretty easy. What do you think of this truck? You like this truck? 
You like it? Yeah, I like it too. Nice and roomy. Yep. Does the shifting automatically. It's just a little different than how I like to sometimes, but it's okay. Kick her in neutral, put her in park when you stop, and DRR, and you can shift manual if you need to sometimes. I like it. Reagan approved. Reagan approved. So we got three loads in today, finishing today. Spray the truck off just a little bit and then uh, get her loaded up for next week. December contracts are all full. The 250,000 uh, soybean and uh, 25,000 acre or 25,000 bushel corn. So, and on to the January contracts come Monday. Not sure how much we got to go, but it's a lot. It's mostly corn, not a lot of soybeans, but a little. So. Last home day of the year is in the book. Speaking of books, come back tomorrow and we'll do our books for the year. New Year's Eve, last day of the year. Jay's taking that combine back to H&R so they can start working on it and have it there getting ready to sell somebody else. Layton's out there washing on Garrett's truck. Then me, Dad, Garrett, and David are all uh, completing our end of the year books, which is good times. That's what we're doing today, last day of the year. All right, books are all done. Now the teacher's grading them. Yeah, grading the books. Books are done, years are done, year is done. Mm -hmm. Good year. Best year we've ever had, best <laughs> year. Yields and price combined, by far. Man, there you go, can't beat that. No, can't beat that. There's, there's your interview, you're on the hot seat. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what do you do around here? What What would you say your role is? Huh? What would you say your role is around here? I'd say I'm manager. Yeah, yeah, I'd say you're manager. Yeah. What are you doing in the spring? I uh, sleep. <laughs> Plant beans in the spring. I'm the bean planter. Used to be the corn planter, man. Got kicked out of that job and went to the beans. Yeah. So I'm the bean planter. And fall? Fall, corn picker. Corn picker in the fall. Yep, corn picker. Favorite job, probably. It's a good job. Bean planting's good, too, though. Get yeah. a lot done planting beans. Feel like you accomplish a lot. Summer, you do a little bit of everything. Oh, uh, everything in the summer. Winter, your main main office. Manager, manager. Yeah. Book man. December is just all office. Getting stuff bought for next year, getting things wrapped up for the end of the year with all these different books and entities. It takes a while. Um, then I'll get in the truck some in December or something, maybe do a little equipment work. If it's too hard doing that, I'll get out and get back in the truck. There you go. Yeah. We'll go through your background, but we already covered that in another video. So, okay. Link in the description on that one. Okay. I don't really prepare for these interviews yeah, very well. Your list? I got nothing. I'm not That's Barbara. It? I'm not Barbara Walters. Oh. I, don't, I don't even have a lisp. You're not one of them Fox girls either. I can tell you that. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> well, you got anything else you want to say? These are pretty yeah. short. Well, no, just Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Mm -hmm. Yep. Hope you enjoyed your year. Happy New Year. What's your Ivers merch? Ivers-farms.myshopify.com. Thanks for watching. See you next year. Nope, actually, this comes out Sunday. See you last year. It'll, it'll already be next year. We're speaking to you from the past, from last year. Mm, yeah. So. Time travelers. Well, yeah. We'll see you, we'll see you next week, which will be next year for us, but not next year for you. Long time for at least next year. Yeah.
Yeah. But not us. Tonight. Eli's going home. Yeah, we're leaving Eli. Not home. Eli's going back to the Marines. Tomorrow? Tomorrow evening, so we may not see him for Who knows when. when. Yep. Be glad he comes back home again. We get a lot of good food when Eli's here. Yeah. Thanks, Katie. Eli's mom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep.